essentially like an early 19th century fishery still today, which is part of the reason that there's still lobster around and there aren't any cod around. That was probably, in my line of thinking, the hardest work I ever did because it was steady. You, you, you went, took a day to get bait, cut the bait, bait the gear, and then uh, if you could get it done in time, you'd go right out. I mean, sometimes you didn't sleep very much. That was, that was really hard work, I thought, long line it. A male who defends her when she's soft, when she molts, that's very important. So a lot of, again, the cooperative research that we're trying to do is to make it so it's not so much of a jump off the cliff. And let's see, let's test it. Let's, let's do it as an experiment so you can get those traps back. So it's not a, uh, um, you know, just trust us as we jump off a cliff that we don't know if we're going to fly or not. Like one thing that people were very concerned about was that the traditional methodology by which people enter the fishery remained intact. So that kind of tradition that you were talking about of a kid starting out on the coast of Maine with a skiff and a few traps and building up their gang of gear and ultimately, you know, entering the fishery. They didn't want to create a system that was going to interrupt that person's um, kind of plan. The job we're doing out here, and one of the reasons we do it is because we believe no species should be lost. And the people can not only extinguish species, people can restore species. And, and we can not just cause species range to contract, but we can cause ranges to expand. This is what restoration is all about. And this persistence and optimism are you know, good qualities, I think. And in this project, they were necessary. And that's what I tell all my interns, is that if you start a project like this, Go into it for the long run, don't just start it and quit, because the, the rewards are, are years or decades down the way, and for me it's, you know, that's exactly what's happened here. The rewards are all around us. But.